VGH and UBC Hospital Foundation is the leading charity investing in healthcare innovation in BC. We are celebrating a remarkable triumph with the Urologic Sciences Campaign, raising an incredible $65 million for urologic health, patient care, and research. Your generosity amplifies the success of our 25-year partnership with the Vancouver Prostate Centre in research and patient care across the spectrum of urologic disease. Thanks to your support, established clinician scientists are leading discovery, treatment, and patient care improvements in disease, helping patients live longer and making possible a better quality of life for those living with chronic conditions. Your support has helped attract and recruit new rising stars to the team and train and mentor the future leaders in urology. None of it would be possible without you. Thank you for making our vision a reality. I think that this successful campaign for the Institute of Urologic Sciences is going to allow many, many other areas of urology to follow in the wake of the Prostate Centre and become globally renowned in their particular areas of research and interest. We are one of the busiest kidney transplant centres in North America. And the research team under Dr. Dave Harriman is exploring this concept of one transplant for life. We need to be able to find out more about the reasons a kidney transplant is rejected so that we can prevent it. Another area that's very exciting is our kidney stone research. Dr. Ben Chu and his team have been involved in some of the newest technologies, providing those technologies to the people of Vancouver and British Columbia. This campaign has been really essential in helping us amplify our success through the use of team science and core-based capabilities to help us span the spectrum from discovery science through translational research and into clinical trials that ultimately help deliver scientific advances to our patients faster. One of the big challenges in prostate cancer is something called heterogeneity. We like to think that a cancer is pretty much made up of all the same types of cells when in fact cancers are highly heterogeneous. So that heterogeneity demands a way to uh, segment the disease. So biomarkers like circulating tumor DNA is one way to do that. Capturing all the different genomic alterations that may be driving disease aggressiveness, but also representing an exploitable opportunity from changing from one drug to the other based upon genomics. This campaign has enabled me to have several tangible outcomes. One is something called sacral neuromodulation. So sacral neuromodulation is an innovative technology for overactive bladder syndrome. Through this uh, campaign, I've actually been able to bring this technology and start the first sacral neuromodulation program in British Columbia. This technology is really going to change outcomes for women. Philanthropy can make a huge difference because people can't bring new technologies if no one is recruited to come. So I really do thank the foundation for that because without it, I, I wouldn't be here. Research on infertility and sexual medicine is really important because ultimately over everybody's lifetime, uh, these conditions impact the vast majority of us. And it doesn't only in impact the individual, but it also impacts the couple, the family. Infertility, there are really limited treatment options and the Urologic Sciences campaign has been really instrumental in helping us move forward. So we've been really fortunate in having Philanthropy fund some of the equipment for our research studies. One of the key pieces of equipment has been a new 3D bioprinter. This particular bioprinter allows us to place and position cells in a 3D structure very precisely. And it also allows us to place these cells in structures such as microfluidic chips. And together, these things will hopefully allow us to take a large leap forward in our pursuit of creating a regenerative treatment strategy for patients with infertility. Another piece of equipment that we've been able to purchase as a result of philanthropy are uh, computational software that allows us to work a lot more with artificial intelligence and machine learning. With these tools, we're able to accelerate our pace of research, ultimately helping patients and families. This campaign is a game changer. It will be the first initiative in Canada that has a province-wide approach to providing transition care via a number of caregivers. 
nurse practitioners, social workers, pediatric urologists, academic adult urologists, community urologists. In terms of research, it'll allow us to actually measure our outcomes and quality of life, something we've not done before. The Vancouver Prostate Centre has been my shelter in this health storm. I know that cancer is the number one cause of death in every province and territory, accounting for 30% of all Canadian deaths. And so this inspired group that is in Vancouver, which is now the largest concentration of prostate cancer science in the world, is a very, very important part of why I'm standing here today. Without research, we're not gonna solve this problem. Research begets innovation, which begets a cure. And that's what we're looking for. It starts with the fact that I'm a cancer patient myself. You know, my life has been extended by the excellent treatment that I've had. And then the money's important, not just for treatments today, but for our children. It's really been quite an eye-opener for us how uh, people have stepped up to the plate. And it makes them feel part of a family, part of a family of research, part of a family of giving back to the community and of making a difference. I think every, every day we, we are challenged by our health. So we need the best care and best care is needs hard work and you cannot just demand it from government. You need to be part and parcel of the solution. That's why I am, um, I'm trying to do my best and be part of all these projects that are going around us. I think I, what excites me is really the goal they have. What you see you will, is, is an indication of what you will see. So if they've done it here, then I'm sure they will do it here with the help of the foundation, with the help of donors like us, and I'm 100% sure they will get there. What excites us about this campaign was it's not about bricks and mortar. It's about money to create research, bring additional great world-class talent into British Columbia, and we're gonna make a difference here. We must always believe in the curiosity, energy, and effort of our researchers, our scientists, and our clinicians and healthcare workers. I believe that the success of this campaign will reassure us all that the best is yet to come. Thank you for supporting Urologic Sciences. Thank you for supporting Urologic Science. Thank you for supporting Urologic Sciences. Thank you for supporting Urologic Sciences. Thank you for supporting Urologic Sciences. Thank you for supporting Urologic Sciences.